Hello and welcome to the MAC weather page for this Sunday, October 25th. You can see temperatures mainly in the low 40s cross area, upper 40s cross southeast, lower Michigan with clear skies and low elevation. You can see our cold spot here at MAC is in Nuevo where they're down into the mid 30s. We expect a pretty nice couple of days coming up with plenty of sunshine, highs in the mid 50s to low 60s across the area. Our next chance of rain will come on Tuesday, and we'll show you that in just a minute. You can see the upper, or the, uh, excuse me, rather the uh, lower wind flow direction out of the northwest, bringing that cooler, drier air into the Great Lakes, and that's what will be responsible for the sunshine. You can see where the winds are calm off to the west. That's where that high pressure system is, and as that moves overhead tonight, we could expect, again, temperatures well down into the 30s for a pretty chilly night. If you take a look at the forecast map this morning, you can see the cold front that has pushed well off to the east now, taking the rain with it. And our winds from this uh, high pressure system off to our west are coming right out of the north, bringing the cooler, drier air into the region. And we expect this low pressure system, which is a remnant of Hurricane Patricia, eventually is going to meander its way across the Gulf states. And that's going to bring a lot of moisture up into the area, which will become available for a couple of systems that will pull that moisture into the Great Lakes as we get into the early and middle part of next week or this week. If we take a look at forecast map by Tuesday, We've got a couple of areas of low pressure. One off that uh, to the northwest that came out of Canada will be digging in towards Great Lakes. And we've got another lower, the Texas Panhandle, that's going to be moving. These two will merge in uh, combined forces over Wisconsin and move into the UP. And as it does, with high pressure off to the east, it's going to bring that clockwise direction, pulling this moisture right up into these systems. So we expect a pretty good soaking rain Tuesday night into Wednesday night. Again, most areas will pick up between three quarters of an inch to an inch and a quarter, but we've got to, got to really watch on uh, how far north this moisture can get. As possible, we could get much more than that, but for right now, we'll, we'll call that the uh, amounts that we expect. And you can see that on the WPC where they also are calling, for the most part, around uh, about an inch of rain across much of lower Michigan with much heavier rains down into the Ohio Valley through the Gulf where they could get uh, another eight inches here over the next uh, seven days. So it looks like a more active uh, pattern will develop here once we get into uh, Tuesday. Until then, though, plenty of sunshine. Thanks for stopping by and have a great Sunday and 73s to all.